So next on the show, I wanted to take a look at this uh, brilliant new collection that ViaVision is bringing out of A Country Practice. Now, Collection 1 is now out, and uh, I know there's a lot of people out there who listen to this show who have written to us over the years and emailed us and talked to us on social media about A Country Practice. As you quite well know, a lot for a lot of people out there, I grew up watching this show, and it was one of the shows that kind of made me want to become a screenwriter myself. So these uh, collections are so, so rare to be able to get hold of. So it is absolutely brilliant that ViaVision are bringing these out. Now, Collection 1, as I said, is out now. It's 34 discs, and for those that have been asking us, it contains the first three seasons of A Country Practice. Now, if you never watched A Country Practice, but you want to go back and, and start watching it, I still recommend it because even though these episodes aired from 1981 to 1983, they still resonate with today's society. Like the uh, the opening episode has um, Dr. Simon Bowen, played by Grant Dodwell, um, working with a young girl who wants to go on the pill. And of course, uh, she can't do so without her um, her father's um, help like and permission. And she knows that he won't give her that. And Simon thinks that's kind of wrong. So it's kind of funny that even though we talk about um, where we are these days and how society has changed, this show was already talking about those things. And I know a lot of people kind of look back at a country practice and think, oh, it was kind of a daggy show. It actually wasn't. It was a show that actually used to generate people uh, talking about stuff. Now... And talking about topics that needed to be discussed, there was a... This was kind of like during a time when television was changing in Australia. We had shows like Number 96 coming out, which um, opened up talks about sexuality and things like that. A country practice every week would kind of look at social things that were happening. And then that would be the, the talk all through the week on talkback radio, people talking over the fence... Um, to their to their friends it was a show that changed the way that we saw things now if you're going over the first three seasons which is what you will get with this um collection one from via vision you're going to meet some of the the favorite characters there's terence elliott played by shane porteous who's a doctor there's frank gilroy played by brian wenzel who's the local cop um there's shirley dean and she later becomes shirley gilroy played by Lorraine desmond she's like the receptionist at the local clinic uh there's of course esme played by joyce jacobs um who's the kind of the town busybody, but she's a nice busybody. Then there's like Bob, played by Gordon Piper. Cookie, played by Sid Halen. Cookie runs the local kind of club that everybody goes at. Gordon Piper is the jack of all trades that, that's always there. Um, y- you're going to have, yeah, uh, Brendan, played by Shane Withington. Um, Penny Cook, playing Vicky. Molly, played by Antony. There's a cast. There's a huge cast. But I have to admit, the good thing about going back and watching these is that you don't kind of get inundated. If you start just watching episodes as they air on TV as a as a rerun, you're kind of like, man, this show must have had a cast of millions. It actually didn't. It had like a, a pretty steady cast. People came and people um, go. You you will notice that even as you're watching um, as you're watching like these. Uh, these episodes uh, for the show here that um, the 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 matron changes. So I think it's about um, season three. You'll see like uh, Joan Sydney come in to play Maggie Sloan, whereas before that we'd um, had another matron there. So yeah, if you actually go back and watch it um, in order, well, as this collection will allow you to do, you'll be able to see. The show kind of develop and I highly recommend it. Now, of course, two of the greatest moments of Australian television uh, happen in this collection as well. For those that out there that have already seen the show, of course, you'll know that one of those storylines revolves around Molly and it ended up being one of the most watched episodes of any television show uh, in Australian history. Um, I won't spoil it for people out there that haven't watched it. There's also the very classic scene that always gets nominated whenever we talk about 
what are your favorite moments in Australian television? The famous moment of uh, Penny Cook and Grant Dodwell, Simon and Vicky in the mud trying to rescue a calf. Um, that moment is in this collection as well. I don't want to ruin the story too much for people out there that haven't watched it. All I'll say is this is a great opportunity to go back and explore one of the greatest television shows that we've ever seen in Australia. I'm giving Collection 1 of A Country Practice five stars. As Molly Meldrum used to say, do yourself a favor, go out and grab this and you're going to discover something very, very special.